ladies and gentlemen, this is Michael B. And he's going to be picking all the cards in this draft. Oh, no. Don't do this to me. <laughs> Give me three cards to pick from, and then I'll pick. Uh, you got to narrow it time down. Time Warp. Okay, that's a good one. Glory Bringer. Okay. Frost Titan. God, you're just going to pick all blue cards? Glory Bringer is definitely a red card. He's picked three blue cards. <laughs> Money, money, money. How the snow. Money, money, money. Take the glory bringer. Why? Because we're doing this now. I'm picking all the cards. What? Glory bringer. Avalanche rider. No, wait. Goblin guide. Sorry. It's goblin guide. I feel like I know what you're doing right now. What if we get a sneak attack? What if we get through the breach? But we, we'll never get our goblin guide back, though. Wow. Wow, you told me to take all the picks, and then you took a freaking Emrakul that we're never going to cast. Michael, it's for your own good, okay? Wow, the one time we could do the mono red, you pass it up. I didn't pass up anything yet. See, now we can take Monastery Sosphere. We still can. Well, let's do it then. Pyro with the bits. Happy birthday, Mike Bits. Guys, I actually forgot to mention, it is actually Mike's birthday. Can you guys give... It's not. Can you guys give Michael some happy birthday wishes in the chat and in the comments if you're watching on YouTube? He makes a big deal of it in the video, but he really appreciates it. Like when we get whenever we get off stream, he's always like, "Wow, dude, it's all lies <laughs> and slander, lies and slander." He's like, "Did you see all the people who wish me happy birthday? It was such a fucking awesome thing." And I'm like, "Yeah, dude, people really like you. You're super cool, and like they they really want to show their support. So like, if you guys can give him a, a you know extra birthday wishes, it'd really be awesome, dude." I love and despise you. Happy birthday, Michael. That goblin guy's not gonna come back. Why don't you shut the hell up? You know what else is coming back? Ancient Tomb. Now we can cast them on turn 14. Might actually be Ancient Tomb here. I actually kind of like that. Over Char? Yeah, Char will probably come back. Oh my god. Alright, I'll take the Ancient Tomb. You literally just gave him something and took it away. It's true. But you know what? I think Mike, he... make all the picks. Oh, I love Emrakul. It's my favorite spaghetti monster. I have to take it. <laughs> but you know what? I think he learned a valuable lesson in the process and that sometimes in life, when you get things, they don't last. That doesn't make any sense. I'm sorry, Muggle. There's a lesson to be learned here. And the I lesson think... is you're terrible and this draft is going <laughs> to... We're going to lose this draft. We could have won because we didn't get Goblin Guide. Wow, the Goblin God's going to make it or break it? Yeah. Yeah. See, now, like, we could have picked... What could, what could we pick, Michael? We could have picked... We could still Hold pick... on, I'm thinking about it. Anything we could have picked, we still could pick. Okay, maybe. Okay, okay just... <laughs> Look, we could have picked this card in this pack. No, we can't. Uh... No, we still can. I like Roller Road. We can be blue-red. Thank you. We could also take... Bacchus, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Zenigos. Or welcome. Ghost. Who? Xenagos. Look, you get to pick between these two. Bell ringer. Bell striker. Whatever. Bell ringer, bell striker. It is K command, my dudes. Michael, do you have a minute to talk about our Lord and Savior Emrakul? No. Are you hot? You want this? Pass. Yeah, give me that. I mean, the windows are open. It's like 50 degrees outside, man. I don't know what the problem is. It's just the lighting and the... We're trapped in like a bubble. Chicken or Magma Jet? Uh, actually, that's pretty close. I think chicken's probably I think chicken, better. too. I think chicken, too. We love chicken. Squawk, squawk. Did you like that? Uh, Bitch, no one on the planet like that. I'm going to take Bomat Curry. That guy's terrible. I hate that card. Long time fan. Thank you so much, man. What? This card's great. That okay, card's trash. Poo-poo oh, trash. Poo-poo trash trash. It only deals one. Ever. Oh, no. But it draws you four cards when you empty your hand. If you empty it well enough. Oh, God. My dudes. Michael, happy birthday. That spicy chicken sandwich. Michael. Happy birthday. Uh -huh. What did you ask your parents for for your birthday? Your death. See, we didn't get the goblin guide back. Dimitri, did you try to refresh? Since we didn't get the goblin guide, take that, yeah. 
Bomb either draws your cards or eats removal. Yeah, like this card is great. You're a dum dum. That doesn't know how right. Oh, we got it back. The wrong pack. We got there. Woo, 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 woo. Oh, where we take riders? Hero, I guess, in case we end up white. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It's actually much better than Four of the Rogue, as far as four drops. Oh, the Char came back? Told you. Nailed it. He's so smart. Mailed it. You mailed it? Yeah. What does that mean? I sent in the mail. Huh. Forsake the Wordly just in case. No. Oh, wow. Look at all these white cards. Good lord. It's actually pretty good white cards. Yeah. Turn three, Hero of Blade Hold seems pretty good, too. My name is Michael B. It is my birthday today and every day. Sulfur Falls? Take a Tangle Wire here. So we ain't a Tangle Wire if deck. We're aggressive, yes, we are. No, we're not because we'll have to tap down our own creatures. No, you. Yes, like one turn, but the turn after, they're tapping all our stuff and we're getting in there. Just getting in there. But you should probably just take Sulfur Falls. Unless we end up white? I don't know. We can take swords. Maybe we are white. I think our white's better, right? Yes, be white, and let's take swords. Yeah, I think this is better. Oh, I like a seasoned pyromancer. That guy's good. You can also take another one drop. I think we're good on those. I think Pyromancer's real good. Zealous Conscripts is That's nice. A great Ooh, Stoneforge in. Mystic is good too. Uh, yes. Assuming we get something to go with it. I mean, I think we will. It's only pack two. It's very early. I bet Inspiring Vantage comes back too. Yeah, I passed on that guy. Ooh, Figure of Destiny. And a Thalia? Thalia's better, I think. I, I bet one of them comes back, I'll be honest with you. I think the Thalia wouldn't table. I think the figure might. Maybe we should take away Mike's picks if his choice is Tangle Wire. Wow. I agree. What did you say? What do you think the pick is? I think it's Thalia. I think Thalia is just so much stronger against certain decks. I can get behind that. Conclave Terminal seems fine here. Yeah. The Convoke is good. Yeah, this deck looks good so far. I like how you're using the Amber Flame. Because we'll get Sneak Attack. Or through the Breach. And I guess if we do, we play it. Brimaz. Big Brimmies. Or Crater Maker. I do like Crater Maker because it can kill, uh... Like... Artifacts? Yeah, like swords and stuff, though. Yeah, let's take that. I'd be happy with one Jitte and one sword. That's not a lot to ask for, right? Batter Skull would be nice. What if this went over the top? What if it was more like that? Is that better? Does that obscure your view? I just don't like it. There's something about it I don't like. Okay. So I'm going to go with the other way. All right. Well, that's your choice. I was figuring it could get out of the way of your drink, so you're not having to, like, reach over to get your drink and pull back. I know. I just, I don't know. It feels too weird. I'm used to this. I'm going to take Mana Tithe. That seems, okay. It seems, what? Like, what does it seem? You got to take Port there. I mean, Port's pretty good in an aggro deck. Tango Wire. Hmm, Grim Lava Mancer. <laughs> We're not taking one of dang Tangle Wire, man. Tangle Wire is good in an aggressive deck. No, man. That's where you're meant to play it. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's definitely not. It definitely is. Michael, just stop it. If they can't block, they can't win. I'll put the mana twice on the sideboard. You want to get them? Yeah. I figure we're tapping out every single turn, man. Freaking get them. Like, so you keep taking it out. Why are you doing that? What are you talking about? It's in the deck. No, it's definitely the sideboard. What? It's actually very good in our deck. Mmm. Mmm. 
Puppy dog. I do like the puppy dog. Mono one drops. This is a deck that wants the Six, guy that gets one drops. We're 16 landing it for sure, my dudes. Yeah, and we're definitely manatizing it. I don't know why you keep this weird thing where you keep putting in the sideboard. I don't know what you're talking about. It's like actively making our deck worse. You're actively making our deck worse. 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 It was a nice little nugget you had there. Thank you. Please don't talk about my nuggets. Mike, stop trying to ruin this draft. I'm trying to win this draft. He's trying to ruin it. <laughs> oh, that is a nice table. Jeez. Also makes our ancient team much better. Come on, Inspiring Vantage. The only thing awkward about Asian Team is all our one drops, but... What so am I eating? I'm currently eating Mike and Ike's. Oh, so nice to see your son back on. Yeah, he, he's he been doing good. I hate Abbot of Curl Keep. Really? Yeah, you never want to play him on turn two, ever. So? Just shut up. Uh, yeah, I was trying to tell him about the Gotham's, but he won't put it in the deck. I don't know. I can't control him. What if you could, though? What if you had a remote control? And I was like, beep, boop, 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 beep, 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 boop, boop. What if, what if, what if, I'd, what if that was a thing, huh? Gee, you just don't know. That'd be cool. Beep, 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 boop, boop, boop. My name is Michael B. I thought you were going to put that in the, in the main board. Yeah, I ain't never playing on that fucking wall of omens. That's a good blocker. Ooh. Armageddon, snap it. That is so good for us. Is it? Yes. If we have two creatures on board and play Armageddon, they just lose. It's insane. God, do we just have to be the Armageddon guy right yes. now? Yes. We are the Armageddon deck. That is the nuts. That's like one of our best opens. Oh, Runaway Steamkin seems great. Sure. That's a solid two drop, my dudes. We're not going to trigger it that often, but... What? So whenever you play a red spell, or is it when you play a red spell? Or any, any red spell. Okay, any red spell, good. Michael. Good. Okay. Oh, God. I'm going to put the Stone of Forge in the sideboard for now. And put the Gotham back in. And that's the only change I'll make right <laughs> now. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> I got Mother of Runes. Is that better than Giver of Runes? It's strictly better. It's not strictly better. This is a 1-1. One, one, this is a 1-2. And this can also give protection from colorless. This one cannot. But it can also protect itself, which is relevant. This can protect itself. This yes, cannot protect itself. Exactly. Right, but that doesn't make it strictly better. Well, I still think it's better. I still think we take it. Over Embereth Shieldbreaker. That is pretty good. And it's just a 2-1 two, two, for 2 that also destroys an artifact. We do have Crater Maker, though. Yeah. I like that. I just like the upgrade there. Do we just play both? No, I don't think so. Armageddon might be a free wheel, sure, but I don't know if we want to risk it. I mean, I think anything in that pack that's white or red or both is going to probably come back. Like, Lyra and Lightning Helix are the only two cards that I was even interested in that pack. And both of those are probably coming back. Uh, Riftbolt? It's Riftbolt, yeah. I think so. Or Seeker of Dewey. Mm, I think it's Rift Bolt. Going to the face is relevant. Thank cut you. the Lava Mancer. Eagle One, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. You're going to cut Lava Mancer? Yeah, have you ever played a Lava Mancer before? How are we triggering it? You, you tap a mana. You tap a you tap a, a white source and it actually, you, you activate it. If that were true, I would that would be very good. Is that not true? No. I think we take Wasteland. Over Monastery Mentor? Yeah, how many are you triggering that? Like, we have so many one drops. Like. Yeah, that does make Wasteland a lot. Actually, no, you go one drop, second turn Wasteland, one drop. I mean. Yeah, that's really good. Yeah. Alright, I'll take a Wasteland. I don't love it, but I'll take it for you. 
Hazaret Thalia. Or fight with fire. Nah, probably not fight with fire. It's probably no. I we're never kicking Hazaret. that. I can't go face. Dahlia we don't have any three though. drops. I like Thalia though. Okay, sure. Thalia and Armageddon. Oh, we seems literally insane. have no three drops. Jeez. No, we have three drops. Three right here. Hey, look, another Armageddon. Conclave. Wow. Two is better than one. No other picks in this pack anyway. Jesus. This, Which one's better? This cube has not only one, but two Armageddons. <laughs> See, crew of some kind of wet. Oh, this is the dude that searches for one drops? Oh, yeah, that's a, that's a nice three drop. Yeah, it's pretty good. I'm going to take out Fairgrounds Warden for now. What's that do? It's just the one three that steals it, dude. It's just not <coughs> aggressive. Okay. Oh, make me feel some type of wet. What does Tithe Taker do? Uh, during your turn, spells your opponent's cast cost one more, and abilities your opponent's activate cost one more. Okay. And then when it dies, you get a 1-1. One, one. That seems pretty good. I'm getting excited for Smash and Face. You and me both, buddy. You and me both. So, like, we cut Lava Mancer here? Why? Because oh. you're stupid and you don't know how cards work? <laughs> I think it's our worst one drop. It's definitely better than, like, Zergo Bell Striker. Why? Because it, you Armageddon, you have Armageddon and Ravages of War. Like, we're going to have at least, like, six cards in our graveyard. That's only if we cast those cards, though. And if we don't, we have Swords to Plowshares. Two creatures that might die at any course during the game. Uh, Rift Bolt. Uh, Char. I'm going to take this Lyra. Sure, you can board that in sometimes. Stoke the Flames. Like, I mean, it's fine. It's a great card. You stupid Mitch. It's a great card, and you're going to love it. I guarantee you. I'm going to take this Mishra's Factory. All right, so we technically need one cut here if we're going to play Yeah, I don't know lanes. what it is, though. Don't know what it is. Stoneforge Everyone Mystic. Everyone seems to love Bomat, so I'm not going to suggest that. Yeah, because you'd be an idiot. Uh... God, I don't know. This is tough. Is it one of these two? I don't know. I don't like that. If we want one, Ooh, we I want like to. Seeker a lot. Yeah, Seeker's pretty good. Wow, Fire Drinker Seder, jeez. All right, now we need three cuts. <laughs> well, I'm glad you made it easier. That was really good. Maybe Tribunal? I don't know. That seems good. Uh, Yeah, I mean, it's got Convoke, so it's relevant. <laughs> Is Captain of Eos really worth it? It literally draws us any of these. It's a 3-3 three, three for 3 that draws us any of our 1 drops. What is his other ability? So you can sacrifice it and your opponent can't cast non-creature spells this turn. Oh, so like, if we, we think they have a Wrath, you can sack it? Yeah. That's pretty good. Maybe we could just cut the two Swiss five drops. Still, conscripts is so good though. I mean, glory bringers too for just like beating face. Yeah, I don't think I like cutting those actually. I think we can cut Swiss sphere. We're not triggering it that often. It's probably mostly going to be a one two, right? I agree with that actually. So I think we can cut that. Yeah, we only have one two three four five six seven spells, so it's very. Maybe we cut Seeker for the same reason. Yeah, I think it might be our worst two drop. Six, seven. More like seven, seven. Is the Wasteland too greedy? Maybe. Maybe the Ancient Tomb, too, because, like, we, we're so... No, good. turn turn three, either one of these is just Yeah, great. that's too good, yeah. Turn sure. four, either one of these is also really good. Um, Maybe not Wasteland, though. 
mostly red, right? That might be a mistake too, I don't know. I think it's fine. We have double. So I need one cut. Don't know what it is. Don't know what it is. I think we can cut Conclave Tribunal. Yeah, I guess so. This is an aggressive deck. I have no idea what's right. I the don't know. Yikes, yeah, we, we didn't really have any spots to pick up any duels. Whatever, mana's mana. Is it, though? No. I think we keep. Do you really? We can play two things. <laughs> if we draw any land, we can play two drop. All right, you know what, man? I'll humor you. Yeah, the only land I ended up seeing was Inspiring Vantage, and it just didn't come back, which is fine. This is an aggressive keep, my dude. It's an aggressive deck. I guess that's true. Yep, that sucks. It's going to be a land. Well, that's not where we want to be, but... Our opponent's like, wow, they're playing a Burma Curry and they can't even activate it. What a terrible deck. <sighs> hmm. Maybe swords the the wall. The wall. I guess we can wait till we draw a card. All right, we're good with this game. Gain zero, my dudes. Got him. Sad thing is they'd be at 12 right now. That's really hard to fucking deal with. Maybe they'll attack us. Dang it. Well, they didn't. They did not. Uh, we could dash our Bell Striker here to kill the Zenegos. Not terrible, but not great. Uh-oh. How about a land here, my dudes? Oh, yes. Nice. I don't know how much damage this is, but it could be a lot, right? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh, my God, they put them to one? Good Lord. That's insanely sad. We should put in Lava Mancer. Why? Because we can activate it. No, we can't. Why not? Because it, A, we have no mana, and B, it returns to our hand at the end of the turn. Oh, right. Forgot about that part. I thought I'd just put things into play. Fingers crossed they don't have Emrakul in hand. I mean, if so they got it, they got it. Like, there's no way we're beating that with any deck, I think. Well, getting them in one seems good, though. If we actually killed the wall a turn sooner they would be at negative one. That we would have just killed them last turn, which is pretty nuts. Yeah, so this thing about aggro is there's just like these micro decisions that are super important. <sighs> Fuck. Oh, that's pretty good. Eight, nine, ten, so we go to six. It's pretty good. And that card really turns around games, huh? 
Yeah. Jesus. Yeah. And the Ilhorg is no joke. We can draw things. There's we, we got we more? got draws. Now they still have stuff to play. Post combat thunder my okay. I guess it's a blocker. Oh come on. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. Oh that is insane. They have to have a five five dragon. If they have any other thing, we're pretty much good to go. Cool. That's insane. It's actually a pretty close game though. Uh what's good here? I think we want uh Mana die. Sure. I think we want Tribunal here. Tribunal? Tribunal. I think we can take one of these out. Sure. I think it's greedy to rely on them. And you don't really want to draw two either, so I could kind of see that. Uh, did you bring in the Fire Drinker Shader, or are we playing that? I guess we're playing it. Oh, you're just going to go for it? Okay. So we're basically playing 15 lands now? No, like that's it. not how that works. It kind of is. No, it's not. We're still 16. Dan's, what's going on, my dude? Hopefully, you know, dude is gender neutral. Deuteroid. Our man is fucking terrible. Yeah, that's the one problem. Red, white, generally. And black, white. Those are both very decks that are like double, 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 double. Yeah, they're really greedy as far as color concerns go. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Oh, God. I just played Fallen Order. You guys gotta get... I'm gonna... I... Uh, I went through a whole thing. I bought it on Origin. The Origin store. And then EA was actual shit show. So then I returned it. And I'm just gonna get it on Steam. But yes, I still have to get it. They just burn their face here. We take four. They take four. Oh, God. That's fine. Feels so bad, man. Feels bad, man. Just draw a red. That was good. Mm. Look at this beautiful chicken. I'm old. Good night. Wow, that's aggressive. Did they just have six their whole turn? I believe they did. Cha-ching. Oh, we just... <laughs> Got him, boys. Well, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's what that whole EA thing was about. It was a fucking nightmare. Apparently, someone else on Orig on the Origin server, on the Origin game service, has the name Frank Lepore. And I was concerned with it, and I wanted my name back, and they wouldn't give it to me because they're like, well, someone else does. There might just be someone else named Frank Lepore that has this name. Uh, you know, you're, it might just be someone else with the same name as you. And I'm like, it's not. Hey, man, do we big time here? Bring in Lyra. What's that gonna do? Don't they just kill it with their friggin' dragons and shit? One of their dragons they do. The other one taps it can't down. do it. Oh wait, it's not Bane Slayer. Never mind. Yeah, man, it doesn't have pro dragons, my dude. Yeah, I thought it was Bane Slayer for some reason. It is pro so dragons. Forget my about dude. that deal. Don't worry about that. Forget it. Forget I ever said it. Forget it. Forget it. Forget I ever said it. Can they draw stupid wall blossoms one time? No, Michael, you can't. Well, I mean they. No, Michael, they can't. That's unfortunate. It's really good against us. Mm, two red with five white cards. I don't know. That seemed like an easy keep to me. Mm, I see. This seems like a great hand. However, which four drop are we keeping? Well, I don't think we're aggressive enough to keep the Armageddon here. I was thinking that. Because yeah. our one drop isn't like like a, a very aggressive one drop. And I feel like if we do land this, it's pretty great. Yeah, it's pretty good. Like drawing the planes there too. That's good. Let's draw one more red and then never draw another land for the rest of the game. <laughs> wow. What about them five drops? We'll deal with that when we get there. Oh man, look at that little guy. Hey, little biscuit. See if we'll trade. That'd be great for us. Oh, yeah, I'll trade with that guy all day. No? Okay. 
Your funeral, my dude. It is your funeral, my dude. Oh, that's not going to do it. Sure, draw some extra cards, please. I dare you. Take eight. Do it. Hmm. Could just rift bolt that thing. Your other option is... Crater Maker kill it. But I like having Crater Maker for other things. It's, like, it's worth it. I mean, it's like why I sacrifice a dude when we can just rift bolt it. Plus, it's one extra card for this Lava Mancy. It's true. Chansey the Lava Mancy. Come on, take eight. Ta half your life total. Do it. <laughs> Jesus. Mike's getting real aggressive right now. He's never going to do it. You don't think so? You don't think he's going to take eight against the aggressive? Well, maybe he'll take four. No. Dang it. thought he might take four. Don't be a hunt master of the fells. That'd be gross. Oh, that's fine. Oh, I got Crater Maker for that, too. That's actually pretty brutal. I think we Crater Maker it. I don't think we can afford them to, like, Ilharg us. Uh, well, they get a turn to Ilharg. And then we get to attack with everything. So if they just go play Ilharg. Yeah, but that's only if they have Ilharg. What, what else could they have? I guess we haven't seen much. Well, else. if they have Dragon Lord of Tarka, it's also pretty bad. I thought Dragon Lord was eight. Dragon Lord of Tarka is seven. Well, either way, we're attacking, so we can do that first. It's really close. No, I think it's definitely get rid of it. It's probably too greedy not to, right? Yeah, because if they go Dragon Lord, they just kill our whole board. They kill Hero Blade Hold and like Grimlock Vance or Tide Taker, and we have no answer for that whatsoever. You're not wrong. Like we lose on the spot if they have it, and they have Sylvan Library to try to find it. So, yeah, that's a good point. Ilharic has five or six. Five. Hope they don't have it. Yep, yep. <laughs> Typical. Oh, that's a good draw. Ooh, that was a real good draw. I mean, they get a bunch of life, which kind of sucks, but... I wish we had a land here so we could play Hero Blade Hold. Yeah, that'd be good. Be a lot better than oh, that's... God, it just goes back. Oh, God. Hey, how does that work? Oh, I forgot that happens when it gets exiled, too. I hate those cards. What was it? Just, like, go to the top of their deck? It goes to the top three cards, so they just get to choose it with Sylvan Library and play it again. Oh, wow, that's gross. Yep, that's terrible. Didn't know that. Oh, that was actually terrible. I'm actually, I think, I feel like Armageddon would have been great here. <laughs> I'm not sure if there's another play for it, though. Yeah, that's silly. Cards that just can't be killed, they're stupid. <sighs> yeah, we just play it. I guess I hope you don't have your stupid idiot. Just hope he doesn't have... Dragon Lord with Tarka? I mean, they do. Like, I'm not going to assume they don't have it. They just always have it, so. I will hold my finger over the concede game button and we'll see what happens, my dudes. They've got to look at a lot of cards, too. Right. So they're going to kill this and probably Grimlock Mancer. And they're going to play something else, too, to deal us, like, exactly 18. <laughs> Yeah. Yep. In he goes. Dragon Lord Tarka, because no one ever doesn't have their their two card combos. Four and one. Wow, oh, exactly the way I said it would happen. Amazing. All well, right. Fun. Had a good time. Did you guys have a good time? I feel like everybody had a good time there. If you if you guys uh, if you guys are in the cube, you should actually play against me because you'll never not get your two card combo. The only time you don't get it is if you f six your your first your, your second or third turn. So it will always be in the top eleven cards of your deck, which is pretty sweet because getting two of the, the the combo the two of the cards that you need for your combo in the top eleven cards is actually really hard. So if you guys just want to play against me to do that. Like, I think that's actually a really good strategy. But it was not a good time. It's true. You are correct. Sure. 
Yeah, it's okay. We're going to get him, okay? That's going to be the most important part of this draft, my dude. We're definitely going to get him. Should have swords the plant. Right, I agree with you. I mean, we didn't know that at the time, unfortunately. <sighs> yeah, that's better. Another green red deck. Spellskite. I don't even know what I want to discard here. Probably mana tide, maybe? I don't know. Do you just pass here? Passing seems bad. I just don't want to do any I don't want to play this. And ship anything. I guess we can ship mountain like stoke the flames. Yeah, I think that's fine. <laughs> Ravage is four. Dan's with the <laughs> bits for your lightsaber at Disney World. <laughs> wow. Oh man. We're only one ninety nine away from that bad boy. That's unimpressive. Dimitri, have a good night, buddy. See you later, bye. He was a steamy boy. He said, see you later, boy. Michael B. I mean, potentially if we can got him here and then ravages, we're probably good. Maybe. You'd think so. You'd be wrong. Oh, yeah, if they actually tap out for this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Come on, one time. No, they're going to tap six, exactly. It's, yeah. <gasps> oh! This is such, this is such, him. such Dragon Lord of Tarka vindication, Justice. dude. Yes! <laughs> Fuck that card. I hate that card. Also, if you draw planes, we can actually uh, play Ravages, play planes, swords this guy. Oh my god, can you imagine you Dragon Lord Tark on this board? You can go, what is this? One, two, three, four, five. I'm sorry you can't wipe my board, dude. <laughs> Got him. Dang it. The salt of the sea is strong in that one. Doesn't matter. Still wiping. Well, let's go to the next game, my boys. <laughs> what about a good Ravages of War, my dude? I mean, he's not... So They're not dead, but they have... Yeah, I mean, he has... Well, actually, he can't untap that, so he actually is right. dead. Well, no, they take five. They play a land. They take five. They play a land. They take five. <laughs> <laughs> See where this is going? Not going good. Unless I have like one and two drops in hand. Or and along with lands. Can always hate masses. I agree. Oh, they didn't even block. They were like, I'm I forget, I'm I'm too tilted. Oh, they did block. Never mind. There's like a slight chance they can make it back into the game. They gotta crack this and take another point? They're basically already dead. Feels like we've already the damage is already done here, my dude. So they go to seven? Eight? What is that? What? Wait, what the hell is that? Oh, it costs one mana for Tithe Taker to do it on our turn. Opponents activate costs one more to activate unless their mana abilities, so they have to. <laughs> they can't actually crack their Misty because of the Tithe Taker. One piece oh, of your land. Oh boy. And I bet he has a a two damage land too. But he has like breeding. Pool. A shock land, yeah. Or a two yeah. damage land, is that what they're called now? How long have you been playing magic, man? I don't know, man. Shut up. 
Like 10 years plus. I bet he's got that two damage land. What do they call those? I forgot. Okay. Were they magma jet lands? Stop rubbing it in. God. I bet he's got a magma jet land. Dude, it was all worth it for this. Oh, sweet, sweet. Pew, pew, pew. Double got him indeed. I think I'm just going to submit. Yeah. We didn't really see too much from him. Oh, we saw it all right. So we were playing Dragon Lord Tarka and... Spell Skype. Spell Skype. And so Best Salt Monolith. That's about it. You know what? Snapping it off. Run it back. One dot, two drop. Ravages. One dot, two drop. Also, Ravages are... Uh, Crater Maker is probably good against him. Crater Maker. It's like Razor Crater. Oh, now Close I'm playing this. The Hound. <laughs> it's Gregor Clegane, my, my dude. I wish that last season of that show wasn't so bad. It makes me not want to watch it again, even though I kind of do. Because I know how the end. I'm like, oh, it's this. Yeah, like the gonna, rest of the show is still really good. Go, so. I think we'll play Crater Maker here. Really? Why? So we can kill their stupid... I mean, we can, we can do that next turn. We can do both next turn. Oh, good point. But white is our limiting factor, so we can actually play both of these if we wanted to. You make a good point. I know. Bath salts, monolisp. Yeah, that's that's right. Mine, their wasteland taps for a, a color of mana. Amazing. Must be nice. Frag tusk. Deranged Hermals. That's also pretty good. Deranged. Yeah, that's a pretty good blocker. Hermals. Living in the sea. I mean, I'm tempted to just kill this so they can't pay for this guy. It also shuts off their wasteland, too, so that's kind of cool. Blah, 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 Pay your five. You won't. Unfortunately, those one ones are still pretty good against us. No, they're not. They're terrible. Are they? No, they're pretty good. No, I guess they're fine. Oh, God. Oh. I'll block with my... My doggy dog. Snoop Doggy Dog. The dog. That's my name. This seems like a interesting attack. I'm interested in it. Do they not have a fourth one? Deals three to throw away a squirrel. It doesn't seem that great. And oh, do you take it too? No. All right. Well, I don't know what's going on Maybe here. Do they have a wrath? Well, that's a good dude. I think they got a wrath. It might. That's weird that you would think that. I would have sent with the other guy. Really? I don't want to block. Oh, yeah, you're right. Because then if they trade, it's just worse for them. Yeah, I agree with that. I can understand your like point. Cutting off a mana seems fine for us. Also, we get to play Glorybringer into Ravages. I think we're in good shape. Ooh-wee, Rick. Not bad either. I'm probably going to kill this ooze. When they only Seems have good. two creatures to really. <laughs> oh, they can only eat one creature too, which is nice. They're going to get my crater maker. They're not going to get my crater maker. I don't know why they wouldn't. Just gain them They're going to get my crater maker. Gains one life, Michael. You don't know how scavenging use works? I think it's two life per creature? I thought so, yeah. What? Did you really? Yeah. Wow, that card would be busted, dude. It's already pretty good. Here's the question. Do I give it pro white? Yes. Or do I save green, the Mother of Rune? Yeah, or do I save the Mother of Runes for, like, a glory bringer? How are they going to have a glory bringer? Like, if they want to, like, swords the pout, swords, swords this or something. No way, I'm keeping, I'm keeping Mother of Runes up for the... My eyes are on the prize, my dude. What if the prize is protecting your little doggy? It's definitely not. <laughs> Can't even tackle you, probably bring it next turn. That's fine. I just got a wrath. How burial. 
Oh, that's pretty good. Is it? I guess it's not actually that good because we can just kind of kill it again. I'll just stoke the flames it. Or, you know, Flurry Bringer it when you can untap it. Sure. Snoop Dogg. Good ravages here. We actually could ravages here. It's quite interesting. They'll only have, they didn't play a land, so I'm assuming they don't have one. That actually seems pretty good because next turn we get to kill their flyer. I think it's worth it. Is it? And we can pro green our guy because and get him for two. Hmm. I think it's worth it. Like them not having access to lands is the only way they're gonna. I think they're gonna. Ah, oh, it just feels right. It just feels right. They could just concede on the spot too. And be like, forget it. I don't want to. Play. Oh, okay, lol. <laughs> oh no, Billy Biscuits. Green. Get in there. All right. Well, fingers crossed. Fingeals crossed. Can't s stroke unless you get a mountain. You don't know me. You don't know. I'll stroke whenever I want to, buddy. Stroking. Stroke into the east. Stroke into the west. Now it's a race, boys. Watch. They have sword supply shares in there, and just get rid of a glow bringer. It's gonna be like the worst fucking race ever. Oh, that's scary. Blue ring. Oh god. Crucible. Oh, wow. 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 I mean, it's good, but it's not the end of the world as we know it. It's the end of Mike B as we know it. It's the end of Mike B as we know it. And Michael B's. If we draw a mountain, they're just dead because we just get the. Stoke the flames their face. Uh, no, because their glory bringer will not be on. Okay, th they're still dead in time. Just saying. Are you? It sounds like you're being real. It sounds like you're being a real negative piece of shit right now. Well, takes one to know one. <gasps> oh, that's hurtful. That's hurtful. They have four mana here. Well, they they go to two life if they if they do, and then we just get to go pro green kill you. What if they play a blue creature? Yeah. Didn't think about that one, did you, buddy? I didn't. God, Too I easy. Didn't. Too easy. Noise. Not exert is another line. Swear on me, Mom. It's true. You're not wrong. Yeah, actually, we could have not exerted there and then save it. The turn they try to block. What if they never try to... Oh, they're just dead. All right, so we're one-one with this monstrosity. Got him. I think if our mana was good, this deck would actually be really good. I think if our first-round opponent didn't get Ilharg, Dragonlord, Tarka in every Twice, game, yeah, that they won, good. then our deck would be really good too. To be fair, they probably just had Emrakul if they didn't have that. So you know, Emrakul bouncing Did here they still and get there the sack and trigger? everywhere. If you Ilharg it, you don't, right? What are you saying right now? If you Ilharg and Emrakul, they don't get the Annihilator trigger, right? No, because it's it's already passed you yeah, declare yeah. as an attacker. Dan's, so. I'm always thrilled when I still see you in the chat, even after like you get quiet for a bit. I'm always like, oh my god, Dan's is still here. And it's always really rewarding. I'm going to play first. Snoop Dogg the Frog the Frog. <laughs> Did you just make that up? Yes. Wow, that's impressive, man. It really wasn't that hard. I don't think we're keeping. I don't think we're keeping this. No, this is Morgan. Now we're now we're talking. Now you're speaking my language, yo. What are we? Probably Char, right? I like Char because it got Steamkin. Mm. I guess mm. we do have to get rid of something. Maybe Bomat Courier. Yeah, I think it's the weakest card now. You hate this card. No, I think it's trash. No, now I'm keeping it. So now I'm keeping it despite you. I'm getting rid of the Char. That was terrible. That's because we had Ancient Tomb plus our two drop. So? We play one on two, one on three? What does that mean? I don't know, man. Shut up. Oh, they mold to five. Oh, they mold to four. <laughs> oh, there. Hey, man, we're playing red. We got to take them where we can get them. I'm like, this is not what I said. Mulligan, 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 mulligan. You want to go to three? Yeah, they might as well. 
What does that even mean? They might as well. God, I'm so excited. Dan, I'm super. I'm so excited about Disney, dude, and Universal. Like, dude, that's gonna be a friggin' blast. Neon Tokyo Rain. Have a good night, buddy. Thank you so much for hanging out, man. It was so good to see you, Bre Bre Bready, buddy. And uh, thank you so much for the support, man. I really appreciate you. I hope you have a great night. I hope your cookies set what settle well. I just want to experience butterbeer. Have you not? No. Oh, it's so good. I've never been there. It's so good, dude. Everyone says that. So. It's real good. How much does it cost? Like Fifty dollars. Like three bucks a cup or oh, something. Oh, that's not bad. No, it's fine. When is your Orlando trip? I think we're all going in February. Runaway steam can never coming back. Putting two cards under this artifact. Nice. Nailed it. It's a, it is going to be a great I never time. you couldn't look at them. Maybe you didn't. Wow, they're knights whispering against us. That's great. <laughs> Joke's on you. Dang it, you God, stupid it idiot. It's more like the ancient tomb is an idiot. Or the, or the if the mountain was a plains. Oh, God, our mana is so bad. If our mana was good, this deck might be insane. If we could have like three dual lands, I think we'd Do we be like. Do we ship it for the new hand? What? No. <laughs> we can ship it during their turn after we sort the plowshares, whatever they play. True. Or we can just wait till our turn, play lands, play swords, ship it then, get a fourth card. Yeah, I think we're good. <laughs> hey, little piggies. <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 no! What? Do you want to get Goblin Guide? Yes! Whatever, man, you're dumb. <sighs> you stupid idiot. I'm so bad at playing this kind of deck. We could just get a different creature. It ain't a big deal. No. What's your problem, no. Michael? No. I guess it's only good if they have Damnation. And you have the Soul Reed. I did have the Soul Reed. <sighs> now do we even get Goblin Guide? Probably still. I kind of like, I kind of like Grim Lavamancer and Mother Runes here. Grim Where Lava is Grim Lavamancer? <gasps> oh, he's under here. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that little sneak. Still think we take Globlin Guide or Mother Runes? Globlin Guide? Globlin Glide. Globlin Glide is my grass friend. Your grass friend? Yes. Are you on drugs? Yes. That's sad. Can we go ride on Space Mountain, dude? I've never been on Space Mountain because I'm not a big roller coaster fan. I have. It was okay. It was okay. You're gonna kill that guy? That is sad. I'll sack it in response. I don't know why. Like, I mean, if you had a spell, you just play it, right? Here comes damnation for our two one ones. Reanimate that guy. An interesting choice. Do they actually have a one drop? I wonder. They failed to find. Okay. They also took three for that? Desperate play. Desperate play is called for desperate times, my dude. The good thing is if there's any rides that no one wants to go on, like, there's so many people with us that, like, they'll still be fine. Found all the cards that say you lose life. Wow. <laughs> it's true. He did. All right. So. I guess we swords it. I feel like that's correct. You can play mother. Definitely play a red. I think we sack Bowmat. No, not yet. We definitely get an attack out of it first. Well, yeah, I mean, I mean, after attacking. Return of the Bowmat. Return of the Bowmat. Fast passes, I think, are a little bit more expensive. Do we just do it now? Uh, it's five cards. Next time we can play land, get six cards. How greedy do you get? That's one of the questions of Bowmat Courier. Oh, I don't know if there's anything re reason to do on our turn, right? 
Um, technically we could play something, but there's not that much we can play for one red and two colorless, so... I'll just pass here. Yes, they'll be a little more expensive, but... Okay, we're just gonna pass. I'm just gonna try to draw one more. God, the greed is real. No, it ain't. It's pretty real. No, it ain't. I mean, we're saving one mana on on la by not doing it last turn for an extra card this turn, right? Like, I don't know. That seems like a good deal to me. And an extra damage, like, fuck off. <laughs> See, now I'll do it because we got full. We got a full mana. <laughs> pretty juice I think it's this guy yeah oh yeah give me that counter are you counter this this is the rudest shit you could do especially if you're cryptic commanding I'll cry What's uh? Does anybody know what the fast pass price difference is? Oh, they're gonna forbid it, and they're gonna discard days and thought seas. Oh, well, that's sad. Now I wish we had one more land that we can play this hero of blood a hold with. Hero of blood a hold with, yours and mine favorites. Yours and mine favorites. That sounded almost German. Yours and mine favorites. Because the mine. Oh, when you say it like that. Well. So we know they have Forbidden Hand, huh? Isn't that a biscuit? And a half. Oh, that's a chicken. That's a beautiful ass chicken. Oh, that's a chicken. I love chickens. Excuse me? Chicken. I wish you played this first. Oh, Should now we're, we oh, they're going to do something, so now we can play this first. Cryptic that's, Tapper, guys. That would be interesting. Yep. That is That is what they're doing. Get chicken now. Are you? This is amazing what you're doing, my dude. Should we go greedy and play the hero too? No, I think heroes are backup plan. We will play Grimlaw of Mancer. They can go damnation here. Yeah, typically blue black has a hard time dealing with the chicken. You cannot defeat the chicken. It is too powerful. It is Wednesday, my dudes. Dance, have a good night, buddy. I appreciate you. You are awesome. Goodbye. Fucking beautiful. All right, we're up a game, man. Hold on, I'm going to keep you up for a second to see if I can work on this, uh, this chroma key a little bit here. Okay. All right, there's a 40. Oh, yeah, that's no, probably better. I'm going away. Jesus. Is it four fifty four? Hmm. Is it sixty six? OP mold the four and dealt themselves five damage. That's true. Yeah, but I don't care. I don't look a gift win in the mouth. So what do you see? Cryptic Command, Forbid, Thoughtseize, Daze, Doomblade. I'm guessing they have damnation there somewhere. What in damnation? Oh. Jesus, you're disgusting. You're disgusting. Disgusting, big. Remember that time we drew six cards off Beaumont Carrier? That was pretty good. Usually you draw nothing on it, and it deals three damage and dies, so that's why I don't like that card. <laughs> <laughs> Can we get some salami to feed the shrimp cat? No. Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. Wasteland, my wanders. What is that? What are you saying right now? <clears throat> I think we just submit. I already did. 
Mike say, I've seen the atrocities of war with a Tolkien accent. What's a Tolkien accent? I don't, yeah, I don't know. I see the atrocities of war. That's not, that's, no. No one talks like that. I do, every Thursday. <laughs> well, it's only Wednesday, my dude. This hand seems good. Right. Uh, yeah. Salami isn't for cats, it's for your mommy. <laughs> no, that's not true. You can give a small amount of salami to cats as a treat. <laughs> he was just, that was just a callback. Is that a real meme or is that a meme like Dan's made up? Because I really don't know. I've never seen Salami it cat? Else, yeah. I've never seen salami cat anywhere else and I'm on Reddit all the time. Like, just go to slash our memes. <laughs> Hold on. Maybe it's a thing. Hold on. I guess it's a thing. There's... Yeah, this is the thing. I should be fine. It's just a couple of pieces of <laughs> What? Brother. Brother. I should be fine with a couple of pieces of salami as a treat. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Yeah, go, on, so go on slash our memes. Why? Because I want to see if it's on there. No, 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 no. Yes, discard it. <laughs> it is a real meme. <laughs> it doesn't even make any sense. This is the meme we're referring to, guys. Cats huh? can have a little salami. Yeah, this is from eight days ago. I guess it is a thing. Posted by Chubby Fish. That's a good username. Cats can have a little salami if it Showed comes up directly the cubing, from but your I, mommy. But I was uh, stayed for the salami memes, I guess. That's nice. what that's what everyone does. Look at this fat daddy. That's actually a bit of a problem. That's not something that props can fix. We're just going to sort splash shares and give them seven for life. We don't have one of those. I got a Thalia, though. You sure do. Oh, actually. Well, that's too late now, I guess. I got to pay one more for that thing now. That's fine. Is it? Yeah. Watch, we're going to draw four drop. Make salami for your mommy again. <laughs> wow. Do you know this meme with the fucking bodybuilders? Like, wow. No, I guess I'm good. I should have played Thalia first, I guess. Oh, they discarded a thing that's good with flashback. That's great. Right, I think we lose. We could draw swords. Oh, we could have also charred and rift bolted this idiot. That would have been good. Yeah, that might have been good. I would have liked that. I think we're dead now. Yeah, might be dead now. Tell little rascal. I mean, it's okay for him to have a little bit of salami for a treat, you know? <laughs> I mean, let's be honest. Not a salami phase, Mom. I have a white source from Burrow, right? So that's pretty okay. If we do just draw swords, you know. Also, if we can play Season Pyromancer, it's also fine as blocky block boys, but then they have to. Yep, okay. <laughs> yeah, I think we're going to start window to just kill that thing. Easy come, easy go. Where do they come from, Papa Eyes Joe? Maybe we want this guy? Conclave Terminal actually seems pretty good here. Take out one of the Ravages of War. Oh no. Oh yes. I guess it's bad against counter spells. It's bad against your mommy. With the salami. Oh, turn two, run away into turn three. Yes. Yeah, that seems good enough. Maybe we'll draw a 
Are we in the draw or in the play? We're in the play. No, we're on the play. It's my salami phase. Don't mess up and play a planes. I would never do that. Don't daze me, bro. That'd actually be pretty brutal. Not really. They would have to go back to zero lands against us, which is... Now they could have a Now daze. they could daze us. I'm just going to play that instead. Yeah. Plays around daze. And it's also very good against counter spells. And they do play this guy. We... No, I no. Got a fatal push, I guess. They did not. Interesting. A fish Oof. boy? Now I can play Ancient Tomb to play around days. Yeah. But we don't even have to because... Oh, yeah, because they can't. Yeah, yeah they, they can't pay the they, one. They can't counter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, now we're doing it, though, just so we can play two creatures. Yeah, 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 Wow, you're really... You're really stroking out, my dude. I'm stroking. Stroke into the east. Stroke into the west. Mike is the cat. Me looking up online if I can actually give a little cat to my salami. <laughs> like you said, cat to my salami, but <laughs> well, whatever. I'm giving my the little salami. I'm giving my little cat to the salami. It's That's just, dark. it's just a sacrifice, Michael. You just need to know how they work. I don't see any problem here, but I'm sure they'll have some nothing. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. It's magic, you know. Never damnation. Believe it's Even damnation is not that crazy here. At instant speed, no less than during our end step. That'd be pretty cool. Makeshift mannequin? Uh, 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 I was only joking. Heroes downfall are chicken. Now they're going to damnation. No, uh, that's actually pretty rough if they do have that. Yeah, that's pretty terrible. You go land damnation. Ugh, that's fucking disgusting. Wow. <sighs> yep. Cool. Awesome. Glad we're playing draw 16 lands. Can even draw a creature. And now the game's probably over. 16 lands. I feel like some fat idiot here we can't deal with. Kalidus. No Kalidus. Regisaur. That'll do. Mm, not quite enough, but we're getting there. Surprisingly close, though. Do we just do it now? Why? Because they have to, they've shown mono, mono, uh, several counter spells. Okay, that's actually a good point. Do it. Yeah, it's still a three-turn clock either way, so... Man, the number of times we've gotten our opponents to one life has been quite comical. Now they get Iona back with Unveil Rights. They Damn right, and we're dead. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Jesus. Now they name White. Be really greedy. They name Red or White. They name Red. Okay. And I think we're dead then. Swords off the top into a Red Burn spell. That would not work because they go to nine or eight. Correct. I mean, we can play one more turn. To do what? I don't know. Like, we have to block here, so we take seven, go to two, and we have nothing on board. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. What do we draw here? Uh, that's really fucking annoying. You have to have Damnation. You have to have Unbearer Rights, Iona, and Registor to discard it. Like, I don't... The amount of things that have to go right for, like, all of our opponents is just so astronomically crazy. Like, you have to have also Hero's Downfall to get rid of the, the Rekindling Phoenix. So your hand has to be like... Hero's Downfall, Fifth Land, Damnation, Unbearer Rights, Regisaur, Iona. Like, you have to have these six cards in order to put us in the position we were just in. And it's like, okay, I guess, I guess you got it. <laughs> I don't know. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. 
check me out on patreon.com slash and uh cool stuff inc a new article every wednesday so you can check that and uh i'll see you later thanks for watching guys